Oh my god! Oh my god! What it do, Ski? It's your boy, Farewell34, and today I'm here with my reaction video to Doctor Who Season 2, Episode 12. This is the. Oh boy. This is the penultimate episode of the series, ladies and gentlemen, of the season. Last episode was one of my least favorite of the entire series series and season um and it long story short it, it ended off with the doctor's you know ost where it goes something mystical or creepy or scary is about to happen or significant to the story so and he said that something is coming so that gives me the spooks because this is like the ending territory of the season so Things should get spicy, y'all, but let's just dive right into this one. As always, if you enjoyed this video, then be sure to leave a hot like and subscribe if you haven't already. Anyway, though, with that being said, if you're interested in getting early access to these videos and more, then be sure to check out patreon.com slash 34 in the description down below. With that being said, though, let's get this one going. Yeet. This is where I was born. Oh. And this is where I died. Wait, what? first 19 years of my life, nothing happened. Nothing at all. Nothing. Fuck! Fuck. Oh god. I met a man called the Doctor. He showed me the whole of time and space. Bro, how are you finna start the episode saying you died? What do you mean? I didn't get time to adjust my volume. Oh my god. Oh my god. Bro, I'm stressed! Zulium, she doesn't even say thanks. Guess who's coming to visit? You're just in time to be here at ten past. Who do you think it is? I don't know. Not Mickey. Guess. No, I hate guessing. Just tell me. She grand. He's on his way. Any minute. True. Right. Ten past. Here he comes. Does this have to do with the army of ghosts that she just referenced a second ago? <laughs> they just instantly book it. running or screaming or freaking out Why should we here we go torch so are torchwood bad people i'm confused i thought they were like the government's fbi or something or like a small unit that they would help out with anything crazy instead of assisting in this shit we're expecting very strong ghosts from london through the north and up into scotland we got a gust of ghosts coming from the northwest Time to realize that you're insane. We're lucky. What makes you think it's granddad? Yeah, it just feels like him. That's some bullshit. That smell That's some it's your granddad because you feel like it. You've got to make an effort, you've got to want it, sweetheart. The more you want it, the stronger it gets. If they're not ghosts, what are they then? Spirit, aliens. yeah, but they're human. You can see them, they look human. She's got a point. I mean, they're all sort of blurred, but they're definitely people. I'm sorry, Chief, but this ain't it. Pressing themselves into the surface of the world. But, a f but there it is. Anything we can do? The hell? No, I'm alright. It's just. It gets into your head, this thing. Like it's. Kind of reminds me of that uh, alien movie with. Amy Adams, I think? Or Rachel, Rachel McAdams? No, no, no. Amy. They, they made contact with a giant alien sphere. Whatever. Remember the last time we saw a Bluetooth earpiece? <laughs> Little mouth, MSN, in the work office. RAR XD. <laughs> Was it a ghost dimension or something? So sorry there, guys. That didn't take me out of the moment, but it, it kind of did at the same time. But let me explain. Literally, right when the pop-up happened, 
a t I got a text message on my on my laptop because um, my phone's broken, so I only get iMessages. So freaking Ryan popped up and messaged me the minute of that fucking reveal. Uh, that's actually really ironic. I, I said Lammer last time we had an earpiece. Well, that was, and I was obviously signaling towards the Cybermen. And then, what are the odds that what happens there is a freaking Cyberman pops up? That's exactly what I was most likely going to say right after I saw that. So, that's insane. But let's continue. I digress. So, what does the Cyberman have to do with this? That's what I'm wondering. He's trying to be a Ghostbuster? He looks more like a Ninja Turtle with that skin bag. Let's make it a good one, people. Come on, you two. I'm sorry we're late. Save it till later. Sorry we're late. And oh, there actually are Cybermen! They're replacing them with blue... But how's that working? So clearly they have Bluetooths now. Those are Cybermen Bluetooths, but... How does it work? How does this work compared to the Parallel Universe version? Wow, I can't believe I called it. Well, I didn't call it necessarily, but I made a joke about it, and that joke ended up being true. So how does this connect to the ghosts? Dude, they are not going to freaking kill Rose. They were hinting towards something, and I kept saying this entire season, maybe they'll, maybe she'll ditch him like they did with Sarah Jane, but they, that intro just totally just blew my mind. So they... Freaking flustered, dude. Oh, so this is a distraction to backdoor the Cybermen. Oh, no, these are regular people with the earpieces. And they're using them to distract society while they backdoor the real Cybermen. That's it. Jackie Adventure. I don't know, man. I'm just so distracted by the fact that they did an opening. Thing, eh? That's such a far sunlighter. Okay, all in good time, Doctor. There is an itinerary, trust me. Oi, why are you taking that? If it's alien, it's ours. You'll never get inside it. <laughs> Etc. Really? He's acting so chill about that. Her Majesty created the Torchwood Institute for the express intention of keeping Britain great. Fighting the alien so that was a key episode. Does that mean I'm a prisoner? Oh, yes. But we're making perfectly comfortable. And there is so much you can teach us. Starting with this. <laughs> Arrival. That's the movie name. What's wrong with it? What makes you think there's something wrong with it? I don't know. Battle beat him on from 2005. Weird. That's what it is. That on makes you want to run and hide. It's the beat. Like it's it's a vessel designed to exist outside time and space. So what's in it? Traveling through the void. There's all sorts of realities around us, different dimensions, billions of parallel universes all stacked up against each other. The void is the space in between. Oh. Containing absolutely nothing. It's filler. Imagine that, nothing. No light, no dark, no up, no down, no life, no time. Just wait. Show me. Predictions? The Cybermen came in that somehow, or Rose ends up in the void, if that beginning is to come true. I don't get it. What is it? What am I supposed to be looking for? So we built this place, Torchwood Tower. The breach was 600 feet above sea level. It's the only way to reach it. 
You built a skyscraper just to reach a spatial disturbance. How much money have you got? Enough. An irresponsible amount. That's what I say when anyone, when somebody asks how much you've spent on all these Funkos. We're in Canary Wolf. Must be this building. And that hole, you think? Oh, should we leave it alone? Should we back off? Should we play it safe? Nah. You think, nah. Let's make it bigger. <laughs> it's a massive source of energy. If we can harness that power, we need it's always about harnessing with you humans. Britain will become truly independent. But you can see for yourself. Next go shifts in two minutes. Seriously, like. Cancel it. Oh. I don't think so. And I'm warning you, cancel it. Oh, exactly as the legends would have it. Walking from their world, across the void, and into yours. With the human race hoping and wishing and helping them along. Too many ghosts. And. GG. It's a thousand times. Then stop at a thousand! We're in control of the ghosts. The levers can open the breach, but equally they can close it. For how long? He's. Look at him, he's dead ass. He's Sorry? like, he's like, fuck humans. Come on, as you are. Well, is that it? No, fair enough. Some of it, don't mind me. Any yeah, chance for a cup of tea? Go shift in 20 seconds. Hmm, can't wait to see it. <laughs> stop, stop. <laughs> no, absolutely not. Put up a chair, Rose. Come on, watch the fireworks. <laughs> Go shift in 10 uh, seconds. He's like, humans are trash. Let's see Nine, them burn. <laughs> eight. Okay, I've got the blinking piece now. Great. Now, Bluetooths are just synonymous with evil now for me. Sorry, um, they sent me from personnel. They said some man had been taken prisoner, some sort of doctor. I'm just checking the lines of communication. Did they tell you anything? <laughs> Can I see your authorization? Take out the badge. Do it. Sure. She has it. Well, that's lucky. You see, everyone at Torchwood has at least a basic level of psychic training. This paper is blank, and you're a fake. Seal the room. Call security. Samuel. Can you check the door locks? She just walked right in. Doing it now, sir. Whoa! Whoa! Well, if you'd like to take a seat. So these ghosts, whatever. I'm all the way fucked up right now. Whoa! Master. What do you mean Mickey popped up? What do you mean you sh they have psychic training? What was that double bubble right there? Never seen it before in my life. Good. Then we can have a shot. Oh, all right then. It was worth a try. That's that's Rose Tyler. Sorry. Um, I'm sweating. That's Rose Tyler. Who's she? I'm her mother. Oh, you travel with her mother? He kidnapped me. Please, when torture comes to write my complete history. Matt, Bro. Look at these keyboard warriors. How is nobody dialing the Ghostbusters? The next ghost shift was and how are you Let's alive, Mickey? Everyone? Um, maybe we're in the parallel universe. That's the only explanation. Oh my gosh. Things are getting intense, y'all. So Mickey is turned on to Ricky? It's turned into Ricky now? Like, surely they're gonna die. Oh my god. See ya. A new high score. That's the kind of sound effect that sounds like. Yo, this is an ambitious crossover I've never seen. The Cybermen and Ghosts? All we need is Daleks for this to be an intense episode. Even more so. You thought. Are those Ghost Cybermen? Materializing. Oh, uh, that. Y'all really played yourselves. Y'all really did that. What's in that? What you... Oh, what the hell? A railgun from Halo? 
Samuel, what are you doing? My name's Nicky. Nicky Smith. Defending the earth. What I don't understand, the Cybermen don't have the technology to build a void ship. That's way beyond you. How did you create that sphere? The sphere is not ours. Don't tell me! I swear to God, if this is a Dalek. Rose is down there. I swear to Lord Jesus. Yo! I caught that shit! Let's go! Bro! I caught that! Oh! Holy fuck! I don't think I've ever called anything that on the nose before. Ever! Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm actually shook at how much I called that episode. I'm... And that was Doctor Who Season 2, Episode 12. That was my reaction video, ladies and gentlemen. Holy shit. What an episode. The Cybermen. And the Daleks. The Daleks. Have crossed over. Insane. Insane. Holy crap. I don't even I don't even have to say about anything because you guys know how I am. I literally I'm about my shit. I, I don't look at anything, but I cannot believe how much I called that episode. Cause just like just wow. I anyway. The next episode, I, I'm probably gonna have to watch it right now. I'm just too in the mood to watch. I'm gonna, have to, I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna go shower because it's really stuffy in this room. Let it air out a bit. Get another cup of water and then watch episode 13 because that was insane. Anyway, though, but that's gonna wrap it for this video, y'all. What did you think about this episode? I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comment section down below. Again, guys, if you're interested in getting early access to these videos, then be sure to check out patreoncom farewell 34 in the description down below. And y'all, I got a really big surprise for you next episode. We going unedited, y'all. We are doing all unedited. So if you want to get access to that exclusive to Patreon in the description down below, starting episode 13, y'all, we're doing unedited raw reactions. Be sure to check that out. Patreon.com slash fellow 34 in the description down below. Anyway, though, with that being said, y'all, that's it for this one. I'll see you all next time. Peace.